गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हवा यू आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड टूडे डू यू नो वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न योर फेवरेट सब्जेक्ट येस we are learning about marathi i know students you love to listen marathi stories marathi song and today we are learning marathi alphabets so what is that do you remember last week already we have discussed swar and some vyanjane we have discussed okay so children today we are going to learn swar students if you will learn this swar properly then you will not have any problems in marathi you can easily write easily read marathi stories so students are you ready and come on here students here we have marathi swar the students do you know how many swar are there come on let's see a a e e u u ru a a o o am aha these are the 12 swar these are the 12 swar but do you know students now there are two more swars included and they are a o so children there are 14 swara there how many 14 and come on let's learn one by one students here comes your first swar o how do you pronounce say o and what is that picture just identify that picture what is that yes your favorite fruit and what is that it's a pineapple i know you are very interested in pineapple juice pineapple cake and children do you know what we call pineapple in marathi we say ananas what is that ananas a for ananas a for ananas okay now next swar now a what is that say a a do you know this picture you know it's a mirror picture mirror and we say arsa arsa means mirror we call we call arsa in marathi okay and for arsa we say mirror okay a for arsa a for arsa can you tell me any names or oh, just tell me some name of some boys we start with a a for akash a for arti a for a for come on tell me more words aman there are many words start with a okay a for arsa okay now come on let's learn next letter now what is this e e for what e for imarat e for imarat and imarat means what imarat means building we call you know we say building in english na there are many buildings in mumbai okay in marathi we say khup imarat ahe khup imarat ahe okay na come on learn next letter here comes the next letter e e for idlimbu e for idlimbu look at that idlimbu means what lemon we you know we have uh, in summer days we have uh, every time we drank le- lemon juice and do you know just tell me the names uh, uh, any festival name which start with e sound 
Mm, E for E for yes, yes. In the last month we celebrate Eid. Okay, E for Eid. Okay, now let's learn the next letter. Student, here comes a next letter. It's what is that? Just read with me. Say O. Say O. Now O for what? Come on, tell me O for what? Now I will show you picture. Okay. Now wait. See, I have a two picture. O. Now one is Undid, and second one Unta. Now we know what is that picture? Yes, it's a rat and camel. Okay, we say rat in English, and in in Marathi we call Undir. We call Undir. Understood? Now the other one Unta. Unta means what? We say camel. We say camel. Camel means Unta. Unta. Now again, ooh! Now look at this picture. Oh God, very tasty, very, you know, sweet. Can we guess this picture? Yes, it's a sugar cane, and we love to drink sugar cane juice. Correct, na? Sugar cane means what? In Marathi, we say ooze. O for ooze. O for ooze. Now here comes a next letter. Ru. We say ru. Ru for what? Rushi. Rushi. And children, look at this picture. And one more word. Ru for rutu. Now rutu means what? Rutu means seasons. You know, children, in EVS we are going to learn many seasons. You know, many seasons means for how many seasons are there? You know, we will learn about three seasons. One is summer, winter, and rainy season. And look at this picture. And children, for season in Marathi we call Rutu. Rutu here, Ru sound. Rutu. Okay. So here comes our next sound. Edka. What is that? A A for Edka. Edka. Look at this picture and. Egg number egg. These are the animal, and a egg means what number? Egg means number. Now here comes a next sound. A a for what? A for what? Children a for what? A for what? Children, you know in Marathi we say egg, egg, egg means what? Listen, egg means what? Listen. Now egg means what? You know, in English, when we say listen in Marathi, we can say a for aik. Now, how do you listen, children? Now, look at this picture. How that man is trying to listen. And in Marathi, we say aik. In Marathi, we call aik. Okay. Now, after a, the next letter is o. O, O for what? And look at this picture. O for what? It's Odhani. We say dupattas. You know, scarf dupattas. And look at this other boy. Oh God, the boy is crying. What happened? Because look at the heavy bag. It's Oze in Marathi. We say Oze. And here are the what? Oat. Oat means what? Children, lips. Okay. The O for Oze, oat, and odni, odni, odni. Now here is the next one. Ow, ow means what? Children, very simple one. You know when you are not well, what do you have every day? Yes, we have our medicines, and for medicine in Marathi we call aushad. We say aushad. So here comes our next letter. That is what, um, um, okay. Now, um, for what? Go on, tell me. Any guesses, children? Go on, tell me. Children, you know, 
in English we write numbers like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. For the numbers in Marathi we say Anka 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 Am for Anka. After um, the next letter is Aha. Children Aha. When we write about Mi Swataha. When we talking about ourselves, that time we can use aha. Here is the picture of swataha. Aha means what? Swataha. Okay. Swata means we are talking about ourselves. Okay. Now let's learn the next letter. Here is a next sound that is a. A. It's a new letter. Okay. So a for bat. Bag. Bat means children. Whenever we are, whenever we write bat, we always write. When we always use a sound, a swear. Okay. A for bat. Bag. Okay. Bad. Here is a next sound that is and the last one or or for office ball okay office ball when we write office when we write ball we use a swear okay a and a these are the new swear included in marathi swear so here children we have learned 14 swear okay we have learned 14 swear so let's revise one more time children here are marathi swear a a e e u u ru a a o o um aha a a a for ananas a for arsa e for imarat e for eat u for we have seen u for what do you remember children yes come on tell me yes what is that u for u for undir u for unta Mm -hmm. And the next O, the next O, O for O's. And Ru, Ru for Rutu. A for what children? Egg, number egg. And A for what? Eggne, Eggne. O for what? Come on, tell me. Oat, Odani. O for Aushad. And what is that um come on tell me um for what one guess children what is that word um for what yes yes you know we say numbers and for numbers we call anka anka okay next is what aha aha means what means what a for bad and O for what? Office. Okay, students. You will watch this video again and again for understanding. Okay, you have to be very good in swear. You have to learn swear. Once you are a master in swear, once you understood how to use words in Marathi reading and writing, then you will not have any problem. Then you will be perfect in Marathi. Okay, students. Bye-bye. Take care.